What, but you're, you've stopped the mustache here, and I need you to grow it here. Keep going? I don't know why you have it Because then it becomes handleable. You, can, you, think, you guys ever handle? feel no, can waves you, can you of it? sadness? <laughs> <laughs> you ever feel waves? I think like everyone, the ocean? Like the ocean? No, 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 no. I'm just boom, talking boom. about Hold on, maybe everything's quick. fine. You're with people you love, and yeah. all of a sudden, a wave of sadness hits you. You know what? And Brian felt it on Sunday. No yep. hope. <gasps> and, and you ever feel that? Yes. And Brian calls that. And Brian yeah, reaches called, out to me. That's called depression. And everything's fine. You got a beautiful life. You yeah. wouldn't ask for anything more. Yeah. <laughs> and all of a sudden, <laughs> dread hits you like a hey, ton of bricks. Hey, dread, where the fuck did you show up? Yep. Hey, hey. Yep. Uh, hey, dread. I'm with my kids right now. <laughs> Take a back seat. I love how the internet called this. I love how the internet comments. Social media, the TFK subreddit. I love how people call this from minute zero. And I think I might have been somebody I didn't call it. I think I didn't. I missed this. But I remember early on, people were saying, this guy's depressed. He's going through it. He's fucking broken. I remember people saying it. I didn't really see it at first. I thought, I think I believed all the fucking, you know, the social media posts, the I'm back and ready and doing what I was doing normally. I think I kind of bought into it a little bit. I didn't, no, so I did put it. I kind of believed that he was in a good space, but people were calling this from minute zero, minute one. Sorry, when it first happened, like he doesn't look like he's all there. People were saying he's lost it, something wrong with him. He was depressed, and he's basically admitting now himself that he's depressed. <laughs> that he has waves of sadness hit him randomly. <laughs> realizing that there's no hope he's never gonna get and that's the thing i said before i think honestly this is a really strange take but i honestly think brian callen has more of a chance of rescuing recovering rebuilding his career in mainstream hollywood than chris D'Elia does even though chris has probably more potential than him more range than him a higher ceiling i think if brian really wanted to make an effort to get back into hollywood he probably could even though he's got the rape allegation over his head, I think some people would excuse the rape allegation over the diddling allegation. There's just that pedo one. It's just, it's too much. Can you imagine how quickly the articles will be spread if Chris got confirmed on some new Netflix show or something? They would have those articles on Variety, Deadline, on Business Insider. They'd be they, on Los Angeles time, they'd have like one of those new articles about him regurgitating the new same allegations in different words. It won't be worth it for a studio to hire him because he's just going to be too toxic. So he must know, and I'm sure his agents probably told him like, stand up is it. It's stand up and podcasting for you. There's nothing else on the horizon, which is kind of insane, which is not kind of insane. It's just interesting because it also is a display that, hey, that's what he actually really wanted even though he's doing this and he's got fans and it pays his bills, what he really wanted was that big mainstream red carpet love. Yeah. No, oh, no. you won't? <laughs> yeah. I'll wait it out. Yep. Now, <laughs> does that happen to you a lot? Now, he sure does. A few times a day. Yeah. Dread, uh, dread, every day? Dread's an interesting thing. Yes. <laughs> no. Yes. yes. Every day. As my. <laughs> yeah tears of a clown every day christopher <laughs> yeah of course Piss it out. so dread is interesting talking about judge red a lot of people get the case of the judge brendan's got the emotional range of a fucking of a ruler in it brendan's got the emotional range of a 30 centimeter ruler there's a moment in there this exchange even when he's trying to trample over it and make jokes where they could have a really introspective sincere moment talking about what they're talking about even though again none of them have got any excuses they probably both are guilty in my opinion allegedly i think they probably both done what they've done and probably more far worse so they got away with it really because in any other walk of life you get accused of what they get accused of you can't even work right anymore there is no work for you your kids go hungry your wife leaves you yeah you know i mean it's the end but these guys are privy position so they don't really have to start in that regard but there was an opportunity there for Brendan to kind of like dig a bit or or maybe probe and ask some questions to kind of get them to open up about their experience and I don't know, whatever. He doesn't have the ability to do it. He's like, every day, Chris? No. Every day you get sad because of the career that you spent 30 years 
building up from scratch with the help of your dad. Um, and it all went away like that because of one girl's tweet. You think about that every day. No way. You think about the fact that you'll never be on Netflix ever again and that you're never going to be invited to a red carpet event in Hollywood ever again and you're never going to be able to have a TV show on Prime, you know, TV networks and channels and shit ever again. You you think about that every single day. No way. Brendan can't comprehend that people who have worked their entire lives for their career would be depressed that their career that they worked their entire lives for is completely gone. <laughs> like he doesn't get it. It's like no way, no way. One more time. <laughs> Dreads. I am the law. Yeah, I am the law. You get a case of the judge dreads, but the question is. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god. Yo, everybody that called this the depression arc is so tr- is so correct, man. I can't believe I missed it. I can't believe I missed this. People were calling it from the beginning though. They were saying Brett Crystalier is not all there, man. He's not happy. He's definitely depressed. He's definitely going through it. I was like, nah, he doesn't look like it, man. He's dancing, he's topless and shit. He's gyrating on social media. Nah, he's definitely feeling sad. I was like, oh shit, here we go. <laughs> <laughs> he's looking like a sad bird how do you get out of them? it so one idea is so sad he's on his phone texting some baddies the question is how do you get what's up babe I, I, i'm just doing this shitty podcast i'll be finishing about two when we in the hotel room look he's tapped out as well over out of them. it so one idea is oh no clouds are there sun's always there but the clouds there wait till they pass yes two is practice what don't jump it off don't cliff. give all the Secrets. content from off limits on this podcast you're right you're right and a lot of this is off I limits unless you pay for yeah, it yeah 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 so, a lot of this so is off don't limits. give it away for free just unless, give them a taste give them what a do taste. you do don't what do you do when you get a case of the old you, you work out that that's is why he's what working I out that's why I he's got. working out so yep. it hit me yesterday and you know how i know you're depressed you're jack yeah 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 that's funny yeah no i did i i what kind of laugh was that what kind of laugh was that do, what don't. do you do when you get a case of the old you, you work out that that's is why he's what working out that's why he's working out so yep. it hit me yesterday and you know how i know you're depressed you're jack <laughs> yeah. he's even laughing not even the same way that is just like a polite laugh for the sake of laughing right you pay your bills he's your new best friend allegedly yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's funny yeah no i did i i actually was i felt it yesterday I was driving and I was like, okay, I don't want to go to the gym because I feel sad. I'm going to go to the gym and it's going to help. And I did and it did. You're, po- you're special. That's what they're yeah, special is the best thing you've ever done by far. Oh, uh, thanks. What? I don't think you could have ever written that without going through no way. everything. No way. He had, no to way. Grow, he had to grow up. Yeah. No way. Brendan telling someone else to grow up. <laughs> Brendan saying someone else had to grow up. Huh? <laughs> Come on, man. Come on. The jokes write themselves, isn't it? You have to grow up. You're there fucking imit. Like, anyway, look. Let's just. You have to grow up. Bro. Bro. Brother. 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 <laughs>